Uh, what? Okay, so power, I'm, I'm gonna repeat myself. Power first, lightweight, um, explosive endurance is gonna be second, which is lightweight, but not as explosive. We just go for longer. So um, before, I'm gonna do some band work in the, in the warm up, but just the warm up. So otherwise you'll just need pair of light dumbbells or light weights and a, an object later, an elevated object like a chair. So like this, or like this little spin thing that I have back here little kid spin thing. I'm going to be spinning on that while you guys are working out today because that's more fun for me than watching your form and working out with you. Um, all right, so let's go. Get your music ready. Get your next phase Bethesda playlist on Spotify playlist ready. Here I go to everybody's muted, but I'm going to meet you again. And all right, so I'm gonna pick my music, but we are going to start off. Let's just get start off in our dead bug position because getting your core ready is always a good place to start. So on your backs, on a mat, if you got it. I'm gonna have my phone out because I'm going to be picking out my music situation. But let's come on back, knees up, arms up. Your shoulders can be down or up if you wanna make it harder, but what does not help show is that low back. So tuck your tailbone in. Low back is pressing on the floor. And let's take an opposite leg and arm, extend it out, bring it up, and alternate. If you're newer to this, which you guys, if you're here with me now, you're not newer to it, but you can always, again, take your time. This is not exercise you have to go quickly through. And let's go, go, go. I need my music so I can start to get pumped up. Keep it up, keep it up. I need to see you guys. Good, good, Stephanie. Lauren, you better have to whip that dog. <laughs> Gotta get that dog in check. Okay, keep going, a few more seconds. 10. Now we got music. Music just makes such a difference in the zone now. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Go ahead and rest for a second. Legs straight up. Let's lower one down. Keep that lower back down if you can, or put your hands under the butt. But just, just go one leg down and up. Keep it up, and now let's just go a little quicker. Debbie, look at that beautiful picture of you. Hey, Debbie. I was like, who is this model coming into class right now? Five, four, three, two, one. Keep both legs up, now reach for those shoelaces. 10, nine, keep it up, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, go, come on up, for, sit up. Just give your abs a quick second. I just want to do a quick Russian twist. So recline back, chest is out, and just rotate here. You're about 45 degrees. And again, I'm using my little kid spinner here. I'm going to just do this all class long. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Come on up. Get your feet. Let's get a leg up. Get those hamstrings moving. And if you want to walk with this, if you got a room where you're at, go for it. Adds a little different dimension to it. Good, Debbie. Real good, Debbie. Whoo. I miss this playlist I haven't had back in the day. Number 96, if you can, if this is pre-recorded, you can pause it. Three, two, one, good. Now I just want you to bring your arms across, open up your chest. And I want you to now take your arms out, move them in circles. Move those circles the other direction. 
three, two, one. Now let's do those reverse lunges. Put your hands up. Tailbone is tucked in. Three, two, one. Good. Now I want you to take your right leg, curtsy. So bring that knee right behind that left heel, and then take that right foot and step it out to a lateral lunge. So we're gonna go curtsy, lateral. Toes straight ahead, bottom of your heel pressing in the floor. And again, since this first round or the first half of class is gonna be cardio, after this, we're just gonna get some band work done and then go. All right, stop, hit that other leg. Again, press the bottom of those heels down, toes forward. Three, two, one more. Good, jumping jacks, let's go. Good, 10 more minutes here of jumping jacks. Five, four, three, two, one. Hands up, feet shoulder width. Give me some deep squats. Keep those heels in the ground. Press the floor away through the bottom of those heels. Five, four, three, two, and one, good. All right, let's take the band on. Spin, if you have it. Well, I know all of you have it. So let's put it around those ankles. All right, lateral steps to start. Toes are straight ahead. So you can see those toes and let's go. And let's go. Nice, let's do it again. And good. All right, in and out squats. So we're here, but each time our feet are out, we're dipping down. Okay, let's three, two, one, go. Good, keep it up, keep it up. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, rest, wide stance, toes are straight ahead, and let's walk with it. Keep going. Good. Let's do it again. Keep those feet wide. Good, feet together, slide it above your knees. We're just going to do some jump squats and then we'll get started with the next part of our workout. Not get started because we're already moving. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Good. Good night, RMA. Good, Stephanie, let's get it, good. Good, Lauren, good, Debbie, five, four, three, two, one. All right, bands off. 
You, I know what you're thinking. Wait, did he say bands? He always says rubbers and act like it's a cheesy condom joke. I'm just getting older. I'm getting more mature. Okay, so three rounds, 30 seconds each of the first two circuits. Okay, so power first, endurance second. So again, 30 seconds each. This is a high velocity, as much as you can muster. Okay, the, the more force you put into it, the more muscle contraction we'll get. So first one we're gonna do is a re reverse lunge jump, sticking with one leg. So we're here and then up. Again, sticking with the same leg, 30 seconds. Second one, we're gonna go to the other leg. After that, we're gonna do a plyo push-up, which is just going to get a plyo means jump. So get hands up the ground. So here, hands up the ground. You can have your knees. And if you don't wanna get your hands off the ground, then you're just going to as much force as you can, okay? Explode away from the floor. And our last one, we're then gonna flip over and do a sprinter sit up, which is here, okay? We're going to explode, think of a sprinter motion, but we're doing it on the floor, working our abs, okay? So let's go. Start with that reverse lunge jump. I can't wait to watch you guys work out here. This is gonna be so great to watch. Three, where's my, two, one, go. Again, reverse lunge, heel presses down, explode. I want you to feel this front heel drive down to the floor, use that to propel up. Almost halfway there, already. 30 seconds goes quick. Again, as much force as you can muster with each rep, I want you to ask yourself, is that as much force as I have? Do I have any more velocity or explosion in me? Three, two, one, good. Other leg in three, two, one, go. Heel presses down. Halfway, more than halfway. Ten seconds, less than ten. Let's go, let's go. Three, two, one, good. All right. Plyo push up. If your knees are down, just make sure your butt does not stay up in the air as you lower your body. Three. I'm gonna wait for even time. Three. If you lose the explosion, just keep doing push-ups. Three, two, one, go. We're not going for quantity, we want quality. If you have any questions, type them in the chat box. Three, two, one, time, good. All right, just flip over on your back. Sprinter sit up time. Three, two, one, go again. Try to keep your low back down and we're exploding up. Just don't knee yourself in the face by being overzealous. Feel that low back, hit the mat best you can. And time, good. All right, now let's do it again. What I think we're gonna do is just do this one more time, then do the next one twice, and then do them each back to back, just for, just to spice it up, just for variety. But let's go back to those rear lunges with the jumps. Right leg first, three, two, one, go. Again, drive this heel down, slow it up. <clears throat> I 
Good, Naomi. Good, Debbie. Yeah, Debbie, dunk that basketball, girl. There you go, Lauren. Nice. Good, Stephanie. Almost there. Three, two, one. Good. Other leg. Three, two, one. Go. Ten seconds. Three, two, and one. Good. All right. Let's go to the plyo push ups. Three, two, one, go. You guys get 10 seconds. Good, good, good. And time, good. All right, flip over, sprinter sit ups. Three, two, one, go. Good, keep pushing, good, almost there. Good work, nice Stephanie, five. You got this Debbie, four, three, two, and one, time, good, all right. Turn that down. So next one, I'm just gonna go over this real quick, broad jump. What I call the turbo rows, which are just holding your weights here, shoulder blades back, and we're just going with force, just again, kind of like a reverse punch. Then we're going to do a plyo squat, which is really our in and out that we did with the band, but now we don't have the band. And then turbo planks, which I'll cue when we're there, but that's everything tight when we're on a low plank. So. Let's start with that broad jump. And everybody knows the broad jump. And I don't need my mat right now. All right, here we go. Three, explode. Remember, as much as you got. Two, one, go. Nice. Excellent, excellent. 10 seconds. <clears throat> Three, two, one. Good. All right, grab your weights. Okay, bend over, shoulder blades back pocket, abs engaged. Weights close together. Three, two, one, go. Again, abs engaged, so you're sturdy through your core here. Think about, I want you to think about drawing those elbows up all the way so that weight is right outside your rib. Good, Lauren. Good, Debbie. Woo! Keep those weights within your knees. A little bit easier to manage. Three, two, one, time. Good. All right. 
plyo squat. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, and one. Good. All right, turbo plank. So on your mat, plank position. We're gonna go low plank on our elbows. You're gonna make a fist. Flex your elbows towards your toes. Gonna come up, flex your toes towards your elbows. Three, two, one, go. Tuck your tailbone in, squeeze. Again, squeeze. Flex towards your toes, toes towards your elbows. Tight, tight, tight. Four, three, two, one. Come down, everybody down. Three, two, one, back up. Let's go. Everything is tight. Glutes, quads, squeeze it all. Three, two, one, down. Three, two, one, up. Three, four, three, two, one, down. Good. Go ahead and rest. We're going to be doing that in a little bit, but one more time through. And then we're going to combine the first one, circuit one with circuit two. All right, broad jump to start. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, good. All right, turbo row. Three, two, one, go. Halfway. Keep those shoulder blades back. Squeeze them. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. All right. Apply a squat. Whew. Three, two, one. Go. Or you can get that butt lower on that squat. You can get down, girl. There you go, Debbie. Good, Naomi. Digging his staff. Three. Two. And one. Good. All right. Let's get those planks. Here we go. Squeeze the shit out of everything. Three, two, one, up, go. 10 seconds, everything you got squeezing. Three, two, one, down. Good. Three, two, one, up. Three, two, one, down, three, two, one, up. Tailbone tucked in, 
Flex those toes in. Three, two, one, time. All right, nice job. You know, since Wednesday was the last day I taught, I want to acknowledge how crazy that day got later in the day. <laughs> crazy day last week. All right, so we're going to go one time through everything. So back to the first one with the reverse lunges. Just hang with me. I don't expect you to remember things because you're too distracted by my handsome, rugged, good looks. So it's not your fault. It's my fault. All right, so... <laughs> So everything all together. So eight exercises, 30 seconds each, and then we'll move to endurance. So this is the end of the cardio explosive phase. So that means I want everything you got. All right, here we go. Reverse lunge jump, right leg to start. Three, two, one, go. Ten seconds. Three, two, one, time. Good. Other leg. Three, two, one, go. Twenty seconds. Ten seconds. Three, two, and one. Good. All right. Plyo push up. Here we go. Three. Two, one, and go. Again, you can be here and explode up. That's your modification. Center foot, center sit ups. Three, two, one, go. Keep it up, keep it up, come on, come on, five. You got this shit, come on, three, two, one, time, good. All right, broad jump. Three, two, one, go. Ten seconds left, come on. Three, two, one, good. All right, turn by row. Three, two, one, go. Oh, 
four, three, two, and one. Good. All right, plyo squat. Three, two, one, go. I'm watching, I'm watching. Good. Good. Excellent, Lauren. Good, Naomi. Excellent stuff. Get it, Debbie. Let's get it, get it, get it. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. All right. Planks. What turbo planks? I just. I just said the word turbo in front of exercise and you guys get it. All right, 10 seconds, squeeze everything. Here we go. Three, I'm gonna throw in obliques at the very end of this one. Three, two, one, go. Everything tight, squeeze your fists, flex your toes in, tailbone tuck, squeeze your glutes, squeeze your quads. Three, two, one. One time. Three, two, one. Back up. Three, two, one. Down. Focus on squeezing everything as hard as you can this last one. It's just 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Go. Three, two, one, good. Stay here, recoup for a second, but then come up to a low plank and I want you to dip your hips side to side. If you can't keep your tailbone tucked, which you might not be able to depending on what you're feeling after that exercise, just skip this last one. You're just going for 10 seconds though. Five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Nice job, y'all. All right, so we're gonna do these are 90 seconds. Okay, but we're only doing it once. Okay, so switching to endurance. Again, just 90 seconds, one time. So I gotta make sure that I don't need my mat. But what we're gonna start off is alternating reverse lunges. This time, instead of doing no weight and just jumping, we're gonna just do a, add weight and do a bicep curl. Okay, so one curl as you lunge. You can also lunge and then curl at the top if you want. Next one is gonna be a front squat with a shoulder press. So we're here, squat, press. Third one is going to be alternating lateral lunge with a hammer curl hold. So you're gonna hold your weights here, 90 degrees on your elbows, and we're going to do lateral lunges while we hold. If your arms get too tired, drop them down, keep moving. And then last one, we're gonna do reverse flies. So here for 90 seconds. Okay, so we have a lot of holding weights, so we'll give us a little rest in between each one for our grip. And so I can wipe the lotion. Listen guys, I have pale skin. I get dry skin. I gotta put lotion on the face. It gets in my eyes. They start burning. It's a whole thing. All right, here we go. 90 seconds. Reverse lunge with a curl. Three, two, one, go. Good. 
Good. You're about halfway there. Halfway. I'm just watching you, Debbie. <laughs> good. I'm going to highlight you if I think you're doing a good, if you're doing an adequate job. I'm not going to do it anymore. Let's just do it right here. Keep it up, Lauren. Everybody's watching. No pressure. I like that little painting on the floor, though. We got to take that out of the box, though. We got still got the cardboard around it. I like that big mirror, though. Did you get that thing in a store or online? <laughs> like I can't hear you. I don't know why I'm asking. After class, we'll chat. Three, two, one, time. Nice job, you guys. All right, front squat with the thruster. Put your hands down, weights down so your arms, again, we gotta make sure our grip maintains the entire thing. And also I'm killing time so my timer lines up and I don't get thrown off. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Lauren, you got, we're all into your mirror, just for the record. That thing is awesome. And we need more details of it. Next week for class, you're going to see the same mirror in the back of my room here. <laughs> That'd be so fucking funny. <laughs> all right, third of the way there. One more minute. Keep those heels driving down. Keep that, get that butt as low as you can. You're halfway there. Thirty seconds to go. Almost there, you got about 10 seconds. Three, two, one, time. Weights down, just for your grip. Two more here. This one is the alternating lunge with a hammer curl hold. Again, here, hold it here. If you lose it, just go down to here. Keep your toes forward, drive your heels down. I just don't want you to load the front of your foot. I see that all the time in lateral lunge. Somebody's foot is even, heel is up. Okay, and they're pressing with their toe. Don't do that. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Also, a way to mix this one up is you can just kind of do a hammer curl at the top here. If you don't like that hold, it all depends on what weights you got. And if you can hold them up 90 degree elbow, if not, we're doing a different type of curl for the biceps. Almost at that 30 second mark. Good, 30 seconds to go. So I want you to not bend over towards that foot. You're gonna to try to send, sit that heel back on it. 
sit your butt cheek back on your heel and then and then lower a hammer curl at the top yeah come up and then hit yeah well now we're almost done it doesn't matter it was it's not big of a difference three two one time good all right weights down just to get your arms a rest because we're gonna do reverse flies next one okay Reverse flies is what we have left here. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Depending what kind of weight you have, you can also kind of, if you want, you can do like three and then do a deadlift back down. Just a way to keep moving. If, since we don't have normal weight variety like we would in the studio, halfway there. But again, we're only doing this once. Okay, so fatigue that muscle or those muscles for this one. 30 seconds left. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Woo. Okay. So, last circuit. We're going to need our elevated surface. It could be a wall if you don't have a chair, but you're gonna have your foot on it. So just a heads up. So this one, again, this is 90 seconds each. This one is in honor of Hump Day Today's Instagram post. That's why I put it up, because we're gonna do it in class. We're just going to do a single leg elevator bridge. So, one foot, this heel is driving down, and we're gonna bridge. When your hammies are like, this is too much, just rest for a few seconds, and then come back and to, to it, okay? Listen to your body. Again, you better go on Instagram and like whatever post, because I need likes, just, we need it. <laughs> just do it. But again, you, you'll see the post, you'll be like, oh yeah, that. Okay, so single leg, second round, other leg, third round is going to be dips. On the chair, if you don't want to do dips, you can use weights for a kickback, but dips, you're keeping your butt close to it. And then up, okay? This would make it harder. This takes the load off. And then we're gonna do a bicycle crunch. So fairly straightforward. All right, so lay back on your back, ladies. Get on your back, pop that leg up. Apparently I'm still digesting breakfast. All right, here we go. Again, drive your heel down. And I like to have my butt close to the chair for more range of motion. Three, two, one, go. If you drive that da heel down, you'll notice a difference. And your hamstrings are gonna be like, fuck you. I think I did something like this last week. I think my hamstrings are still feeling it. Ah. Yeah, they are. Well, not what you want to hear, but we're about halfway there. Oh, you can also put both feet down if you want. But you know, we're gonna have to kind of make sure you get balanced with the other side when we get to the other leg. 
So even with me like this, I'm still putting all the pressure on my raised leg. My bottom leg is just kind of like a support to take a little load off so I can make it all the way. Because unfortunately we have still 20 seconds left. <sighs> Again, it's all about pressure on this leg. Even though this leg is down, I'm not really using it to drive up. Squeeze your glutes at the top, 10 seconds. Get it, get it, get it. Oh. Fuck, cramp. Three, two, and one. Great job. Other leg. Oops, go away. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. I'm sorry about this one, by the way. I really am. Almost halfway. If we were listening to the same music, now is when I would start singing to help distract you from the pain with my terrible, terrible singing. Being embarrassed for me is a good thing, way to distract from the muscle, from the workout. 30 seconds left. Keep pumping it, keep pumping it. Woo! And you're humping with the best, ladies. You're humping with the best. <laughs> All right, almost there, 10 seconds. Okay. Hopefully your chair isn't sliding on a place like mine. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice job. Woo! Let's take a second and just slap our hamstrings back into life. Slap some life back into them. All right. Now, dips. So again, you can have a weight and do a kickback here, or we can do dip on the chair. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. I see a comment, I'll be right there. You want your palms, wrist facing away. Right, fingers coming back in. <laughs> nice, good, good Stephanie, good Lauren, good Debbie. Debbie, you kind of got this, your head is like, I'm gonna knock you out. I'm gonna fuck this guy, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do something. Halfway there. Thirty seconds. After this, it's the last one, and we're done. Whew. Ten seconds. I'm gonna finish strong. Five, four, three, two. And one. Oh. I'm gonna do my uh, dirty dancing. I should get a, I'm gonna take a picture of this and then ma mail it to you for being in class today and hanging with me. All right, last one is a bicycle crunch. I'm gonna frame it. So Lauren, you can put that up instead of the picture you got there in the corner of your room. All right, bicycle crunch, here we go, 90 seconds. And then we're done. And since we got enough abs and obliques, we're gonna just go straight to cooling down. I'm not gonna fuck with you today. 
Three, two, one, go. I need, dang, hold on. Sorry, I went to my cool down song and it threw me off. So you guys started earlier than I did. Try to keep that low back down. This is it, y'all. Come on. About halfway. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. <sighs> Woo. All right, y'all, about 15 seconds left. So maybe rest if you need to, I want you to finish strong. Finish strong, let's go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Uh, all right, quick cool down, and then let's find out where Lauren got that mirror. All right, so on your back. Let's go right to a figure four. Cross the leg, pull the other one in. Good, switch legs. Good, run across them. Let's go ahead and stand up. Where are we having time? All right. All right. Right arm is crossed, shoulder stays down. Now, once you take that right arm up over your head, and just really what I want you to do here is just. It's behind your head, and I want you to feel a stretch through your lat, all the way through your tricep. Good. All right, arm across, shoulder down. Good, take it up over your head. Feel that stretch through that tricep, and then lean with it. And up. All right, now right foot is on your heel. You're just gonna bend forward. Kind of stick in your butt back, stretch that hamstring. You can bend your knee too. It doesn't have to be a straight leg. I really put, just feel your hamstring and just adjust as you need. For right here, you get a little uncomfortable, bend your knee, you get deeper. Let's go to your other leg. And come on up, cross your arms, knees unlocked, feet shoulder width, fold on over. Let's slowly roll from the base of your spine, articulate through every vertebrae, reach your hands all the way up. Reach them on wide, deep breath. 
And exhaling. Yay, you did it. We did it. Most importantly, I did it. Great, great job, you guys. And um, we need to talk about that mirror.